Hello everyone, this is Feel Good, Feel Good and Gunpla, and this is Progress Video Part 2 of the AZ Gundam. Last video, we, I was discussing about the head, chest, and arms. Here, I've just finished the legs and the waist. And also, for a good bonus, I even put the shield, got the shield finished. Sorry if I, my voice sounds a little drained, I guess you can say. Uh, uh, I'm just tired, I've been working, so I'm a little tired. I just woke up not too long ago, so... Okay, trying to make sure I don't lose all the pieces because I'm currently working on the backpack and the gun. Now, to start with, the legs. The legs are very nice. Um, very detailed. Even for a uh, high grade, the legs are extremely detailed. It took a minute to finish sanding the legs and paneling them and putting them together. As you can see, it turned out pretty well. Of course, I did some pan line on the feet. So I really like the legs. Um, very detailed. Plenty of opportunity for a pan line. And I did take advantage of that to the best of my ability. Also, the waist is done. Like how they got the thrusters built into the back skirt. I believe the uh, the only Zeta Gundam I built was the Master Grade Zeta Gundam 2.0. And if I'm not mistaken, if memory serves me right, that kit does have like the boosters in the back skirt as well. Of course, you know, here are the like side skirts. On that and also I've completed the shield so now you can see from all the pieces I have here I'm working on the backpack and the gun I would probably show the gun but i think i'm gonna wait because I, I have completed the gun the two guns but i decided that i'm gonna wait until i get through the backpack and then on part three i show the backpack and the gun there and because this the backpack is not like normal backpacks I may I don't I may just put the backpack on it and then do the review like that cuz in most cases in most of my reviews I would build the backpack and then I wouldn't put the backpack on until I did the progress video. But I may do things a little different for this part 3. So we'll see how that goes. So all there is left to do is just assemble the lower half. So, Ooh. it's a little hard to try to build stuff on camera. At least it is for me. Gentlemen, don't want to break none. Straighten it up. Now 
I'll put on the side skirts. All right, it's in there. Okay, got the lower half built. I got the shield here. I'm just gonna go ahead and put the shield on the arm. So, all right, now we're just going to, now I'm just going to put this onto the body. Okay, so now so Okay. Yeah, no, it's not the best pose. But all right. Let's see, we got the main body of the AZ Gundam complete, plus the shield. So, all there's to do now is put together the backpack and the gun and then i can start recording footage for the review of this kit So, all right, then, like I said before, the main body of the AZ Gundam is complete. Part three would be the backpack and the two guns. So far, it has taken some work. It has taken some work to do this kit, to get it completed. Um, but despite that, Unlike most kits, you know, it, it has took a little extra more, a little extra work to do. But then again, it is modeled after Zeta and Zeta Gundams typically take more work to build, at least in my experience. However, despite being taking longer to build, more work to get to look right, it has been the, one, one of the kits that I have had fun with. It's been a fun build, basically, even though it takes longer to build it. At least in my opinion, it has been a fun build. I am enjoying this build. Can't wait to get finished and show it off in all its glory when I have everything done. Until next time. I hope everyone enjoyed the video. I appreciate everyone taking the time out today to watch my videos. I really appreciate it and it means a lot. And I wish everyone a good day. Later.